When a user visits a website, a unique session identifier is generated and stored as a token. This token is often stored as a cookie on the user's device. The cookie is used to authenticate and authorize subsequent requests during that session. A session typically refers to the time a user spends interacting with a website from the moment they log in until they log out. Session hijacking involves an attacker intercepting and taking over an active user session. This unauthorized access allows the attacker to assume the identity of the legitimate user and potentially perform actions on their behalf. One of the ways to conduct a session hijacking is a man-in-the-middle attack. This happens by intercepting communication between the user and the server to capture session data. Session fixation and session sidejacking are two types of techniques that hackers use in order to implement a successful session hijacking attack. Session fixation happens when attackers fixate a user's session identifier, forcing them to use a session controlled by the hacker. While session sidejacking happens by capturing unencrypted session data from a user's network communication. The best way to prevent such attacks is to avoid using public Wi Fi and implement a VBN. Thank you for watching the whole video. Remember to activate multi factor authentication. Stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one.